Shalom brothers and sisters. This is uh, Jim Fincham. I'm a soil scientist. I live at Chardon, Ohio, and I've known uh, my brother uh, for about five years. Uh, he has convinced me uh, that I must be sharing my testimony continually. And after this weekend, I'm really ashamed that I have not done more. Uh, my father gives me opportunity almost daily but I can see now from his teachings that uh, we need to be out there promoting our Creator and His timeline continually. Uh, I am bowled over by my brother Joseph and his ability to uh, research. The, mind, uh, the guy has a, a mind like a steel trap. Something goes in, it doesn't get out, and he's able to access it, and he just blows me away. The whole concept of counting by 49s instead of 50s has opened my understanding tremendously. I, I knew next to nothing without that concept. And here it is, it's been in Leviticus 23, uh, 26 for forever, from the beginning. And we really are amiss if we don't begin to listen to what Joseph is saying because the Father is giving all of this information for a time such as this. And if we do not open our mouths, the whole world is going to die. My understanding is, even notwithstanding, that it's the Creator's work. It is not our work. Our responsibility is to know everything we can know so when the Holy Spirit brings us to someone who needs a testimony, we open our mouths and we share truth. We must, and I like a, I've got a pet saying, it must be non-GMO seed. In other words, our understanding of Torah must be pure and true or what we're sharing is of no value. It will even mislead. So the things that I'm finding with Joseph, I uh, found him in 2010. I bought the, Ju the, the uh, Jubilees, the Prophecies of Abraham, digested them over a three-month period, and everything else he has told me since uh, has just been something my spirit had to envelop and, and utilize. Uh, this is so critical for this time. Uh, this weekend and his teachings have just emphasized painfully how close we are to fulfillment of what the saints back in Yeshua's time were expecting to be just around the corner and everyone since who was a believer. So what we're finding with 49s that we didn't find with 50s is, is so revelatory and so pertinent. And all of the other teachings that he is uh, developing simply grow from that understanding. Daniel's timeline was total false, and I had bought into it, but it was dead end. Uh, you didn't know what was coming. And now that we know Jubilee cycles are 49 plus the 50th is the first year of the next Jubilee cycle, which isn't gonna happen again since we're in the 120th. Now I understand where we're at and I cannot help but believe that it is absolutely the best information out there. I don't know anything either, but I put my confidence that my creator has brought me into this life at this time and he has revealed all this stuff that I know through all of my teachers uh, in addition to Joseph I encourage you pay attention to what's going on all of the signs in the world are, are telling us screaming at us that what Joseph is revealing or has been revealed to Joseph because he's just a messenger uh, are critical. So Shabbat Shalom wherever you are and may Yahweh bless you and keep you in face of what is coming. Be strong.